Hey guys, it's me, the one with the funny name. Yay. So, I'm sorry if, like, I can't speak after a while because my voice is just kind of dying. Okay, let me just this. I look like crap, so I've put a hat on my head. For the people who want to know what my name is actually supposed to be, it's Melissa. Like Melissa, but with a TS instead of an SS or whatever. I'm foreign, but not really. So, please say my name right if you meet me again, or for the first time, if you haven't met me before. Ah! I wouldn't make a video about how awesome these past few days have been, as you can see, because of my voice. Before that I went to Gay Pride, which was awesome. I saw Snaily there, and I saw Poppy and Alice, and probably other people from the street team. But I don't remember who was and who wasn't part of the street team. So that was fun. And then on Monday, we all went to the marathon. I stayed for a bit, and that was very, very fun to meet everyone again. Tra la la. And then Tuesday finally came around. I had an awesome time in the queue. So you should see one of the videos on my YouTube channel, which is Peanut Squashify, I think. Squash I F Y. I don't really know why that's the name. I'm obsessed with peanut squash and stuff. So yeah, it was a very fun queue. Ah, we sang Get Back to Hogwarts on the hour every hour, along with Grange Danger. And I think I've just got a video of Grange Danger, and I think I have a video of the other one that we sang. I have a video of an S Club 7 song, I think it was either Root for the Stars, I don't, I don't remember. And then I went to see Darren Chris and I was in the front line and then Joe Walker gave me his first high five of the night. Went out and Joe Walker magically appeared and then he signed my... Oh, in all the excitement, I broke my sunglasses. Okay, wait. And then Joe Walker signed them but I got really sweaty yesterday when I was holding them and it's kind of rubbing off. And... Okay, that's really bad. Someone just texted me. And apparently Chris Colfer's first word was Oprah. Okay, that was a lovely tweet. And while we were in the queue, um, Katie kept on handing free stuff, so we've got like four of these. I don't think I got a magnet, but I also have a postcard. Oh, I do have a magnet! Yay! I thought this was just another thing. I'll put that on my fridge, even though my parents will be like, what the hell is the street team? You know, I've told them like 50 times. So yeah, Tuesday was fun. I stayed up all night on Tuesday and then I got to the venue at 7.30 in the morning or something. And then I was number seven. This is backwards and really faded. Number seven. But I was still first in the queue or whatever. But the second really because Nicola was in front of me. Hi Nicola, if you're watching this. Had fun with you. Um. Yep. The queue wasn't as fun as it was on Tuesday, which sucks. Cause, but to be fair, Tuesday was just too much fun for anyone to handle. And then I was at the front again, and I nearly got Darren Chris's pick, guitar pick, but I didn't. And I have a war wound about that little scar there. I mean, it was there before, but someone scratched it and it started bleeding again. If it was you and you're in the street team, I'm sorry for threatening to kill you. I didn't actually mean to threaten you. I was just like, ah! So sorry. I won't actually kill you. I threw my friendship bracelet at Darren. And also, I have this list of bracelets I still need to make, so I'm sorry that I still haven't made them. But I promise you I will eventually give you your bracelet. I gave... Mushu two bracelets because I accidentally gave her the wrong one at first. So whatever. I've got this one which I was going to give to Kurt but he's out of the country now and I didn't get to see him again. So I'll give that to someone who wanted navy and red on this list. Um. Oh and then I saw Joe Walker again yesterday and I walked straight past him. We were heading towards the back and then I was like where did everyone go? Why aren't they following me anymore. I'm going there. I walked part back there. I walked back and then Joe Walker suddenly appeared. So that was cool. 
Um, what else do I have here that's cool that I wanted to talk about? Oh, I have another bracelet, which is a duplicate of the one I gave to Rika because I had so much string. But I think I'll keep this. It's, it's a special connection me and Rika have now. And this is just curly. Oh, Dara mentioned the street gym yesterday in the evening gig, which was awesome. And it was all because of Maddie. We love you, Maddie. This was just supposed to be a video about my name. Oh, and Phil gave me a new name, a new nickname, Blitz, because you can't pronounce my name. So she just decided that that's my new nickname. I'm not dead scabbers anymore. So yeah, I've had a fun time this week. And, um, hope it happens again. And I oh, 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 ooh. My friend Poppy was at the premiere today and she got to meet Darren Chris, which was awesome. That's all I wanted to say. That was interesting and fun. And to celebrate... Oh, the Harry Potter premiere. I want to talk about that as well now. This is just going to be a really long video. I'm sorry. This is just supposed to be my name. Harry Potter premiere. I watched it on my TV. And I was just like, where's Darren? And I could have sworn I saw him like three times. But it wasn't him. It was just a lookalike. Whatever. And then he appeared and I started like screaming. I was like, Darren! And then I just like started crying of happiness. And I was like, oh my god, he's in the big screen! And then I posted that on Tumblr, and someone copied my post, and then got like over a thousand notes, which I'm upset about. Everyone steals stuff off me. Oh, it hurts to talk this much. Yeah. Harry Potter premiere was awesome. I wish I was there, but I got really ill and tired. I'm now going to draw a photo of Darren that was taken at the Harry Potter premiere in celebration. And if you want me to draw a specific one, I might. I don't know how to get people to vote for a photo or whatever. But yeah, um, I need people to pick a photo of him I should draw. I actually have my sketchbook and I have something to show you. Where did I put my bag? There. Okay, it was in my bag in the rain and now this is just cut. And this is the sign on the back of it. But it's going to be backwards in this video. No, it's not. I can change it. I can edit it in my movie. Okay, this was our sign when we were at the hotel last week. I did something stupid to one of my... to my infamous Chris Colfer drawing. Where's it gone? I haven't lost it. It's not that one. Or that one, or that one. Maybe I have lost it. No, I haven't. I haven't lost it, but I have ripped it. I ripped it by accident, and it's all very sad. Look how big it is. It's like as big as me. I really wanted Darren and Chris to sign it, but I felt a bit creepy, and I didn't see either of them face to face with the situation. <laughs> that reminds me, I've been watching Ron's Immortal all day. Which is hilarious. Okay, this is this video unedited is like ten minutes long, so I'm going to leave. Okay? I'm gonna leave and edit this and quickly check to see if I have anything else to say. No, okay, bye. <laughs>